Take it outside now live with our traffic cam. Consistent rain at Nimitz and Kalihi on Oahu and many areas across the state. This is just a preview of a much bigger rain event on the way. Our team is declaring Thursday a first alert weather day for the island of Hawaii. Well, that means this looks like a significant event. Chief Meteorologist Jennifer Robbins shows us why, Jen. It's because a Kona low will be meandering just offshore. And with that in mind, some south winds will be coming our way. And weather models are more persistent now, bringing the heaviest of the showers over the far eastern end of the state. That's why we're declaring Thursday as a first alert weather day for Hawaii Island with all of the ingredients coming together. Tonight, we are tracking numerous windward and Malka showers into the night. So we will be seeing saturated grounds. And that's a big concern in days ahead because of the rain that we're already receiving. Taking a closer look at why we're considering a first alert weather day, we're seeing cold air aloft with that cold core system. In fact, abundant deep tropical moisture coming in from the south is going to bring in some snow heavy at times over Mauna Kea, Mauna Loa, initially starting at 12,000 feet, dropping to 10,000 feet, up to 10 to 12 inches of snow. And then Thursday into Friday, the timeline for the heaviest of the showers, Hawaii Island alone we're talking about a foot of rain potentially coming our way. So keep it tuned here. A lot of elements are coming together again Thursday, a first alert weather day. Thank you so much, Jen. A Senate